cold, man. The way too cold Ooh. out there. Hey guys. We heard it. Yep. What? You guys heard it too, right? Wendigo. Oh, it's yeah. literally out there. Uh, right sure? across the lake. We yeah. All the way across the lake. You guys didn't hear it? It was oh, so no, loud. We were, we were upstairs looking mm, around and stuff. Um, no, yeah, there's... No, speaking of upstairs, I think there's something you guys should see. Yeah, some really, really spooky oh. stuff. Okay. Look at this. We walked by saying like, oh, look at these cute yeah, drawings. Just like drawings. But like, but did you guys check what the drawings are? Oh my you don't God, see anything wrong? Okay, that's a little creepy, sure. Um, look at this. Oh my God. What is that? That's, I, oh, that's it, man. The horns. Yeah, antlers. So what is this? This is just like a I bunch of like, like a, thank you for visiting. Our, yeah, it's like, it's like an Airbnb the, thing. You know what they do that? Yeah. And then half of them aren't. Yes, yeah, so no, that, really, that looks like a welcoming Airbnb. Like, look, it's literally like a kid Dude, look at the face. holding its hand. That's the goat. That's the, the face. Goat man, when to go, like it's all the same. Same face. Huh. What is that? But there's it's like a giant a hole. Dead there. There's a body person in, the in there. The ground. There's oh, another one here too. Here, this one. Oh yeah, also another one in the has ground. Like a giant like hole in the With ground. With a person just like smiling on top. And oh, this one's the lake. the lake. This yeah. is us. Look, Jesse, it's us. Wait, that's where we heard it. Yeah, literally across, across the lake, the we heard lake. the howl from across the lake. This is the cabin, I'm assuming. This is so weird. Yeah, I don't think a lot of Airbnbs have pictures like this. Yeah, so like obviously people who have like came here and visited here has had some type of weird experience yeah, with this yeah. monster, right? I think this is the creepiest one. Like, are these, this are, reminds me of like people like burning or something. Oh my God. Always I didn't even see hunting. that. Wait, that's what the old lady said. Always, uh, it said, oh, yeah. What the fuck? Hunts at night. That is what she said. Do you think like she has anything to do with this? I mean, uh, no. I don't think she came unless, wait, picture. unless she is the host. And we just, you know? But she wouldn't, why wouldn't she say anything maybe though? Maybe that was her greeting. Yeah, maybe it was. You said you were waiting for her it, for the weird us. coincidence, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. why, why did she walk by at the same time that we were looking and waiting for him? But it felt like she like literally like, came out of like thin air. Like we yeah. parked yeah, I mean, cars, yeah. she yeah. wasn't there. We didn't see her like walk out of the house or anything. And then she was yeah. just like there, kind of yeah. weird. Hopefully we're not the ones being hunted right now. Yeah. But like the dead There's body. A dead the dead body, body at the, possibly the bottom of the, a hole? I don't know, if so, but we're gonna get to the bottom of it. <sighs> I don't like this. I'm coming down. Ugh. Jesus Christ. I don't know why you're coming all the way. Oh my God. What is this? This will be us. And, and then we'll, the, the, yeah. <laughs> the mystery will be down here. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we'll be up here safe. That might be Nick right there, but that's just oh. neat. I mean, yeah, it kind of looks like Nick. Curly hair. What are you doing? Are you giving him hair? <laughs> He's tried curly hair. There he is. Oh no, Nick! Oh, no, Damn, man. man. Oh, that's unfortunate how that was. That's, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm loving this right now. Mm -hmm. If we didn't have this, I would not want to be here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We're going to pack everything up, guys. We have enough evidence, I would say. Oh, no, listen, listen. What? Bro. You hear it? I heard it like a little bit. The scream. Shh, but a lot closer. Like literally down there, down there. It, last time we heard it was over there, right? So it's getting closer? That was a lot closer. That was like, shh, dude. That's what I'm saying, bro. It's literally right there. Yo, get inside. That, get inside. That was a person. Get inside. Dude, that was a person. Why is someone yelling like that? Well, you, know, you Jesse just you said that you heard it from over there. Right? I heard Maybe it. I'm telling like, you. It maybe yeah, we wind. heard it over there, but it moved. It can move fast too, because there's that was that far, bro. Like that enough. It must have like crossed the lake or something. We must have missed it. That's why I was looking outside because I wanted to see it, see if it was anywhere on the lake, see if it was anywhere visible. But nothing. So maybe it's a good time to like start setting shit up because like if it's getting yeah. closer, like we'd want to like have it like set up around the camp. So yes. make sure that we capture anything if it does like pass through, like walks by or anything like that. All right, guys. So we are currently on the street next to the cabin. We're heading towards the lake where we heard that scream. And the plan for this hike is going to be setting up the last trail cam at any point of significance where we think the Wendigo could possibly be passing through. So any kind of trail or any kind of like marking that the Wendigo would leave behind, we're trying to find something like that. We've already set up one trail cam 
on the lake before we headed over here. We did find some kind of footprint on the lake. So that is why we put the trail there as well as we put a piece of meat on the dock in front of the camera. The Wendigo does like to eat people. What is that? Um, it kind of looks like a tongue, right? <laughs> you actually don't even know what it is. Wow. Ew. It smells really bad. You think the Wendigo is going to smell this? Uh, well, I can for sure smell oh, how much Ew. it stinks. That's so. disgusting. So this is gonna be our bait for the Wendigo. We have our camera set up right here. If mm -hmm. anything does cross anywhere here, it's gonna take some imagery. Um, but let's head to the path. Let's go down the road and go near that stream. So while we're out here trying to find the last place to put the trail cam, the team at the house is gonna be placing cameras around the house in case anything shows up near the Airbnb. All right, I have been put in charge to set up some cameras around the house and I figured a good idea would be to probably put it in that room that we uh, heard a weird noise earlier, just for fun, you know, see if we see anything cool. I mean, the room itself is pretty creepy and there's gotta be something in here, right? So I think we'll be good to go. Hopefully while they're doing that, they're going to be monitoring the cameras at all times, making sure that nothing shows up. Oh, you actually don't know how to play no. chess? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what you're doing, you monkey. <laughs> now you guys are probably thinking, Hi Mike, you're going into the woods, like you're going to get lost. No, this time I came prepared. Shara, what is this? Those are... I don't know. What are they? I don't know. <laughs> I brought some. Spit it out already. What did you What did you bring? What is this? Can you tell what this is by looking at it? Are those like things you throw on the ground? Just the mark where you've been? That's exactly what it is. So these are trail markers, guys. I'm going to be placing these along the road. Obviously, for right now, we've just been taking the road, so it's pretty easy to know where we're going. But I'm just going to put this up for now just to show you guys a little demonstration of how these work, you know? I know it's kind of complicated, especially Shire. She has no idea what's going on. So we're gonna put this right here so we know that this is the right way and we're always gonna put it on the left side. So as long as we're heading back and this is on our right, we'll know that this is the right direction back to the car and to the Airbnb. Did you hear that? What? Shh. Okay. We gotta start heading out because the sun is going down and it is gonna get dark soon. And I, for one, do not wanna be out here when it is dark, especially with that thing running around. So let's keep going down the path and hopefully find some kind of evidence that the Wendigo is here in the forest, alive and well. Dude, check this out. What the hell? There's like a, so it's like reviews, I guess, when people like, they, they stay the night and they leave like, you know, their little sentiment or whatever happened. Yeah. Um, this one said <laughs> some weird, weird stuff. It's like, Last night may have been the most terrifying night of my life. I was woken up by the sounds of something in the fridge. It wasn't my husband because he was out cold next to me. I decided to go and see for myself to see exactly what it was. And as I turned the corner, believe it or not, there was some kind of monster in the fridge eating all of our food. What? <laughs> okay, look, look, it continues. I was in a state of shock and I didn't know what to do. I tried waking up my husband, but by the time he got up to see it, it was gone. You should read the other reviews on here and you will see what I'm talking about. I'm not crazy. I know what I saw. Lock your doors. That's strange. I, like, I, I remember reading Airbnb reviews. And really? It's, it's there's a lot of really similar things, but I just thought of like yeah, just like reg regular we reviews, have but literal like handwritten hand proof. proof. Yeah, of people like living here and like, seeing some crazy and crazy experiencing things. it, you know. And on top of that, there's other reviews too. Look, it literally says, "Stay inside." Like it says, the outside is not safe, especially at night. I saw it. I saw something. I can't even describe it. Just don't be stupid and stay indoors. From Steve. Okay, from, from Steve. Steve. Are there are there more? Oh my god. What is that? Lock the doors. Lock the doors. Lock the door. Something about the lake had my kids under some kind of trance. Trance. And not in a good way. It was honestly very creepy, and I'm not sure if I would ever come back. 
Bro, there are multiple people experiencing this. This is. Is there any more? Like, no, what's, no, what, what else do we have? What does that say? Um, I would recommend everyone to stay inside the cottage at all times if possible. I had a very terrifying encounter with a mut mutant deer. The antlers. The, the antlers from. Oh, it might be yeah, the Wendigo. Yeah, that, that makes sense. This sounds crazy, but it is true. Stay inside at all costs. Thank you for letting us use your wonderful cottage. That was in October. I loved staying here and spending every single day wonderful views in October. Okay, so October, and this one was in August. August, yeah. Same as last year, we had a lovely time. Your place is great. So it seems like their bad reviews are only coming when it's winter time. And that's when the Wendigo comes out, right? Yeah, that would that like, make sense. So like all the reviews in here, pre like December, before the snow. Yeah, comes, seem to be good. All just regular reviews. And then huh. it starts getting like really, really crazy. That's so weird, man. What the frick was that? Michelle, did you hear that? Huh? Did you hear that? Hear what? That like noise coming from inside the woods. I don't know, do you hear it? You, you don't hear that like, weird like howling? What knocking? Howling, not knocking. You don't hear that? You didn't hear that. It was so loud. It was like coming from over there. I don't hear anything right now. Okay, wait, 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 listen. Yeah, I don't hear anything. Okay, well, it, it was right here. Maybe give it a couple more seconds. I don't know. There but there was there was something right over there. I think I saw something. Oh! What the fuck was that? What is that? Shh! Something's moving over there. Do you think that could be... I don't know. It doesn't sound... Like, we haven't heard any Wendigo sounds. We're just hearing, like... Yeah, Could I'm not saying that that was a Wendigo sound, but th there was definitely some freaky noises coming from over there. Well, there was most something animals, over there. animals, I think, are like in hibernation right now, so there shouldn't be any bears. Deers might be running around the woods as I well. I mean, though, deers definitely don't howl. Yeah. That could have been a loon, you know? Just a loon, a, a loon flying by. I think I would has... know if it's a loon. All right, guys, so we made it to the trail that we think is going to take us to the lake the fastest, but surprisingly, we have found some footprints, some yeah. human footprints, which obviously means that somebody else is on this trail. So maybe we'll catch up with them. Why are you outside right now? Like I can barely speak because my cheeks are so I know. cold. Like I don't I know, know if you can notice, but it is really hard to talk. And obviously we are on a mission. We are going to the lake for a purpose. This guy, whoever this person is, I want to know why you're outside just for fun. You know, they say uh, the Wendigo does bring blizzards. So this place recently just had a blizzard yesterday actually. So that's why there's like so much of the snow here. I don't know if you could tell, but we just climbed over that whole hill through knee deep snow. We're finally here. I'm gonna put this right here. Haven't found anything of significance. We're still following the trail or what's left of the trail. We're always keeping these along the way just in case we do get lost. So we're just gonna keep following this. What the f That was it. We're getting close. That was so loud, Michelle. What the? Oh fuck? my god. That's okay. insane. We're gonna try to get a little closer to that noise because that is where we want to be. We want to be exactly where that noise came from. Um, Nick, look. What? Is that the old lady? What? What is she doing here? I don't know why she's outside. That's like really, really weird. And look, look at this. Look at this. The camera went off when we were playing chess earlier, and we didn't look at it. But look at this. She's literally. That's at the door in the basement. And it looks like she's... I'm telling you, bro, that's the pro... This is her... It has to be her property. This has got to be her Airbnb. It has to be. Here, mean, wait, like, let, me, let me go back. Let me go back. Where, where'd she go? I, I don't know. No. Okay, no. Here, get the camera. Get the, get the camera. Yeah. Wait, we got to go up. We got to go check for this. Okay, this yeah, yeah. That's it really makes no idea. sense. She was just out there. Hello? She was just like up there, right? I'm gonna go check the road. What the hell? I 
telling you guys, she was just right here. Hello? This makes some... What? Jesse, what? Dude, we have a really, really big problem. You see this? See what? Look at this. What is that? Kind of looks red. Oh, there it goes. Oh, see, right there. See that? A frozen gummy? Look, it's everywhere. Right over here. Oh my god, look at that. What is that? Oh. Hell that, looks like. that does look like blood. Oh my, oh my god. What? Oh, what yeah. the hell is that? That's like. What I is that? A ton. Of blood. Uh. Oh my god. Hello? I obviously can't tell if that was like fresh or not, but like. Because it's frozen, but like. This is. That's really, really bad. I don't know, like. Why is it like that? There's Freeze. literally something like hanging right above Imagine us. Imagine a whole body. Okay, well. That's weird. And it's in the shape of like. It kind of looks like a massive footprint, right? Yeah. Okay, well, let's uh, let's keep her moving. What do you what do you mean keep her moving, Michelle? There's a big pile of blood right here. Like, is this not a good enough place to to put the cam? Um, I guess so, eh? What do you mean guess? Like, this is this is not a window go enough? Like, well, like where should I put it? Just like off the trail here? Yeah. And like we just like head back? Yeah. Hurry up, though, I'm yeah, I'm getting uh, pretty cold too, so. Guys, look, I literally am shaking because of how cold I am. Okay. Okay, you're joke. exaggerating. This Come joke. on. It's. Like Michelle, your beard is literally frozen. <laughs> is it actually? It's frozen. Oh no. Yeah, I'm definitely the coldest I've been in a long time. But I'm gonna grab the cam. Did what? you hear that? No. I think I heard something. Yeah. Are you sure? You didn't hear that? No. Michelle, like I'm not one? tripping. Either I'm I have supersonic ears or you're just deaf. Because okay. I definitely heard something. Let me just set this up. It's gonna be too long, don't worry. It's literally frozen. Oh, it's, it's doing okay. <laughs> I'm sure I'm sure it's still edible. Mm. No worries. Mm. No. You look like that. that movie with with Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh really? Yeah. Um, Put a little picture what's just it called? for reference. Grailed? Not grilled. No. Uh, the Revenant. Thank you. Revenant, yeah. You we should put this away and yeah, get probably. going. All right, put that there. Ugh. Yo, Jesse. What? You, what you missed did? something here. What do you mean I missed it? Look, so it's, it looks like it's it's all normal at the very beginning. Yeah, that's what I was reading that. Read the end. Except some, some strange encounters with the neighbors. It's a thank you for letting in the cottage, blah, 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 blah. Everything was great except for some strange encounters with the neighbors. The, the old lady. The old lady. Okay, so what? it's not just us. Everyone else is doing yeah, the same and thing. Even, even here, read what it says. I love staying here. Every day spent here had us all enjoying the wonderful views. That's normal. Yeah. However, we heard a few strange noises that night really close to the cottage. Fair warning, it could be a bear living around here. Hmm. That's that's weird. Maybe it's those sounds that we were hearing earlier, that's you know, insane. like on the water. Was that? What, what was that? that? That was downstairs. I think it was downstairs. Shh, careful, careful, careful. Is anybody down here? Yo, those notes have me spooked. Dude, the, the camera. I put a camera down here. And the door, it's closed. That's what that noise was. You kept this open? Are you sure? No, no, bro. I put a security camera down here. Cause remember how we heard the noise earlier? Yeah, yeah. Is there? Hello? Hello. Where's the camera? Where, where did you put it? How did this, dude? What? What happened? Like it's where... off. It's good. Wait, where, where, where did you put the camera? Bro, I'm telling. I put it right here. It was literally like that. How did it fall off? This doesn't make. That doesn't make any sense. Something must have like knocked it off, right? Bro, I'm telling you there's something in here. There's clearly something in here. 
that doesn't even want to be recorded either. Okay, well let's let's just go back we, upstairs. This yeah. is this is getting a little crazy. Now for some reason after the camera fell on the floor, the camera just suddenly shut itself off. However, a few moments before the camera falls on the ground, you can clearly see the camera start to move on its own as if something else in the room was moving it. just missed it. What was that? Okay, guys, we're literally right in front of the cabin. Thank God. It just got dark like literally like 10 minutes ago. Glad to be back. We do not want to be running around in the dark with that thing out there. Oh, hello. 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 Welcome hello. back. Damn, it is chilly out there. Yeah. Chilly, scary. Dude, we heard some weird stuff out there. We, we have some, some pretty bad news too, yeah. Yeah. Oh, um, so we were outside looking for something because we saw on the security cameras that uh, that old lady. Yeah, she came was, back. Really? And on, on top of that, she was actually at the basement door, like the sliding what? doors. She yeah, was yeah. at our door. The like, like, stairs, yeah. But we, we, we weren't paying attention and we, we did pay attention. We realized that she was actually at the other camera outside. And then we went after her. And, and then, uh, um, we noticed, I noticed like something hanging out of your car, like this like weird tube. And uh, what? yeah, what? no, you're, you're it's laughing, laughing now, it's not, it's not gonna be funny in a sec. Yeah. Uh, it seems like she siphoned all of the gas out no, of we'll, your car. We're not sure if it was her, but she's but the only one we've like seen. One yeah, there. it's just literally like the, the puddle and there's just like gas like on the floor and it's it's not uh, not looking good. Oh I, I don't have your stuff. keys so I couldn't like verify but it smelled, it reeked of gas. So in other yes. words, you're out of gas, Michelle. Yeah. Let's see. How much did she take? Okay, battery's still on. Okay, see if it starts, I guess. Oh, it's literally not turning on. Bro, we're like in the middle of nowhere. Why? We have no Why? Oh, this is that's so bad. What are we gonna do? 